following in Canton for you. A huge fire starting at a recycling plant last night. Crews have been there for hours and they aren't leaving anytime soon. News 5 Sarah Finney has been there for us all morning. Sarah, still a very active scene behind you. Very active indeed. Mona Cruz continue to spray this building for hot spots. You can see the roof is completely gone at this time. Firefighters are looking around. At last check, I was told they are not going inside. It's simply not safe at this time. You can see one firefighter on the ground. He is uh, spraying a hose into the building, so they are going at this from several angles. When crews arrived around 10, they found the fire nearly throughout the entire building. Half a dozen surrounding departments were called in to help get it under control. Firefighters were able to stop the flames from spreading to a new section of the building. The Slesnick Company has been in the recycling industry in Canton for decades, so this building is filled with paper and cardboard, making it even more difficult to fight. And the building uh, is actually the company's recycling headquarters. I'm told the owners were here overnight. They are facing a big monetary loss. At this point, we don't know what started the fire, uh, but that investigation certainly underway. If you're in the Third Street and Savannah area, some streets are closed off. This is close to downtown, so be aware of that as you head out this morning. Live in Camp, Sarah Finney, News 5.